Remember this, the gag gift, the chattering teeth? Oh, yeah. <laughs> well, they've been around since the late 1940s. And the inventor of those chattering teeth <laughs> is still around. And at the age of 100, he is <sighs> still creating toys. KKL9's Amy Johnson is here to show us what else he's doing these days. Wow. Well, Juan and Susie, it really is amazing that he is still creating and making toys at 100 years old. He says doing creative things keeps his mind and his body young. It's a gag we've all seen. This is the man who created them. I really have the teeth correct because uh, my dentist gave me a pair of false teeth, so I copied them. Eddie Goldfarb has invented more than 800 toys and holds close to 300 patents. He's still going strong at 100 years old. This is the bubble gun in action. Two years ago, a documentary was made about the Thousand Oaks Senior who has turned his garage into something that must rival Santa's workshop. Well, I think being creative in any way is very important. Where you start from nothing, you have a goal to finish something. You might be knitting little booties for your baby or something. That's being creative. And it's nice to go from the beginning to the end, and I think that's... that's uh, uh, very, uh, very important. He built his first toy while on a submarine during World War II. He has since designed a wide range of toys, games, novelties, and hobby kits, including battling tops, a vacuum form, arcade basketball, kerplunk, hydro strike, and giant bubble gun. I believe that doing creative things stimulates your brain, and of course your brain uh, stimulate your body. So I think that's very helpful. Now get this, in 2003, Eddie was inducted into the Toy Industry Hall of Fame, and in 2010, he received the Toy and Game Innovation Lifetime Achievement Award from the Chicago Toy and Game Group. He has now formed a partnership with his son, Martin, and they continue to make toys. The latest invention, Shark Attack.